The number one hospital-induced illness is a pressure injury, commonly known as a bed sore. These injuries occur due to restricted blood flow as a result of immobility and can lead to severe infection. In the US, pressure injuries cost the healthcare system over $11 billion a year and kill 60,000 people annually. Those with an injury have an average increased stay of six days, adding over $43,000 in costs to the hospital per injury. Imagine an elderly family member has just been admitted to the hospital due to a stroke. To reduce the risk of pressure injury, nurses will issue a subjective risk assessment. Then, they'll monitor and manually turn the patient according to non-standardized guidelines. Once in a while, they'll visually inspect the patient's skin for an injury, an error-prone process. The patient might be given a special air mattress, but this provides no insight on high-risk areas, or a sensing mat could be used, but this does nothing to alleviate nurse workload. Unfortunately for many, this is a reality. My grandfather passed away due to an injury. My teammates all have family members who have been impacted, and we're not alone. Over three million patients are impacted by them in the US every year, and the most disheartening thing is that they're nearly all preventable, and this is what we aim to do prevent pressure injuries. The Atlas P1 is a variable stiffness mattress that places a sensing matrix below a series of inflatable pouches. Automatic patient adjustment is supported by large amounts of pressure data. We then use this data to intelligently adjust the patient, reducing nurse workload. Now the benefit from the data is more than just adjustment. We can actually build a patient profile and run analytics, providing patient insight to caregivers. The pressure relief surface market is expected to hit $3 billion by 2020, and this number will only increase as nurses continue to be in short supply and immobility rises due to an aging population and growing obesity rate. Discussions with experts at Grand River Hospital and Baycrest have suggested that there is a huge need for our product, and we are working right now with them to secure our first pilot project. In addition, Bayless Medical will be providing some funding and mentorship as we develop the P1. We are working on our prototype, first prototype and have already validated our core sensing technology. In the summer, we will undergo rigorous testing and patent applications to prepare for a pilot in the fall. The 5K will greatly assist with our testing and our development costs. We will begin by selling directly to individuals and families, as well as private long-term and community care facilities. This allows us to quickly validate and iterate on our technology before selling to public institutions. We are a team of mechatronics engineers with a proven track record of team success. We have expertise in electronics, artificial intelligence, and complex system integration. We have the capabilities to make the P1 a true lifesaver. At Atlas Medical, we are stopping pressure injuries from ever occurring. Thank you.